Hi, hi, I'm Nikki, and we're at the vanilla house again. Yabba. Oh. What? Work revealed. Loves water. Huh? Cherry seems a little obsessed with water for some reason. Toddlers who love water are more likely to do things like splash in toilets, ask to take baths, and seek out other activities involving water. I think we need a splash pad or something. Maybe I can put a little one on the porch? Oh, good boy, Carson. Thank you for going to class. All right, you two, calm down. Happy that there's no kids near him, of course. All right, when do you work? Six hours? I think that mood lit only lasts about six hours. That is gross. Please clean it. No. Well, at least that was the sink closest to you. Can you play with the baby, Marvin? Please throw her up in the air or something. Ah, soon a nibdub. Of course, Mom. Did you just come into the house again? Okay, you came into the bathroom. Bella doesn't care. Okay. No, no, no. <sighs> Give your mom some attention. She clearly needs some. You feel better, Cherry. Yeah. You need to potty. Here, have Grandma potty help you. You're gonna sing a song? Okay, come sing a song. Edge of a breakout. Write in your little book. Marvin's trying to read. Three hours? Try regaining your passion. Ooh. Oh, Cherry really loves to sing. Toddlers who are little singers enjoy singing and tend to s sing at random times throughout the day. Okay, you got six hours to go to work. Okay. And you need to do a live stream? Yeah, sure. She's strict because she wants her to potty. So mean. How you doing, sweetheart? You're in Cashew's room. Oh, goodness. Her spang hurts and she's sleepy. I'm going to... They changed an icon. I'm going to send you to work to get rid of the fear. Good girl, Cherry. Don't throw a fit. Bella, she wants to go to sleep, so read to her. All right, buddy, you got to get to work. Is that just for you? I guess you found it somewhere. Can we not reach this? Hi, Mom. You're going to eat peas? Okay. 
eat some peas, do your homework. Did you do it? Baby in bed? Awesome. You should probably go to the bathroom. Beverly, what you doing? Martina, you do not need coffee. You got meat, bud. Just eat it. He conquered one fear. <laughs> oh. Uh. Hello? Random werewolf on the street? It's okay. That werewolf's gone. Give yourself a grooming. Where'd you leave your homework? I think you were in the baby's room. Yep. There you go. Okay. That's good. It looks like I've managed to get just enough uh, eco green to keep it from going full industrial. I added more plants to this lot, and I went over to the rec center, because apparently that's also an industrial lot. And I added ceilings and floors of the eco-hexagon ones to try and use that to fight it. It looks like it's at least keeping it neutral. I don't know how eco-friendly you can be with a rocket on your porch. Somebody said something mean to you on Social Bunny. I'm sorry, Carson. And good job, Bella. Level 5. Hey, Bev, you want to come help with the rocket? I mean, you're hanging out anyway. Come help your sister. Oh, we got another level of the rocket done. Oh no. Okay. Yes, he loves rocket science. He pretty much loves anything Bella loves at this point. Marvin? You can work from home. You conquered your fear. Oh my god. Everyone has died. Oh, if the baby can't answer her phone, don't call her. No. Mom died. I'm glad she broke in last night. I didn't know Dirk Caliente was Cashew's relative. Oh no, Marvin's dad died too, Dustin Pleasant. And Carson's, uh, oops, you're actually my step-grandma has passed away. Oh boy. Well, Carson was getting over his sadness. <sighs> When did Wolfgang die? And Anya, Tomax died too and they didn't even tell us. My first gen, they're all gone. We'll have to go get their graves. Cherry can't answer her phone. Oh, sweetie. Mom and Dad died at the same time. Alright, everyone. It's raining. Go inside. Bella, you're hungry. Why don't you make food? Or you know what? Let's just serve a whole bunch of food. You'll need to make it. Carson, we don't beat things up. You know better. Come over here. Mark your territory. 
Okay, bye, Bev. Go here. Are you gonna run into Bella? Do not destroy the chair. I said no. Go in there. Hurry up before somebody sees you. We don't want you losing relationships. There we go. She decided to watch the cooking channel. Oh, there we go. You need to hibernate? Oh, you want to work on your project? That one's yours, right? No, it's just a random one. Okay. You need to learn. You don't need that. I got you a splash pad. You can play in that. You want to play in the water? You're dancing. Come take a shower. If you're going to work on this, finish it. Marvin went for a swim. You need to practice your football. All right, Carson, I think you should be fine. Why don't you play football practice together? <laughs> Is that fun? Oh? You got cold about prom, even though you haven't been to school yet? No. I wish I could just send you alone. I don't know if this will count as schoolwork, helping with project. Just not learning fast enough to make you happy. Carson, unless you're writing a term paper, you don't get to play on the computer. Bella, hop up. You got work. Marvin, sweetie, you're getting cold. Could you come home? Maybe use the bathroom? Oh, good. Excellent job, Cashew. And Martina's invisible umbrella? Let's go to the park. Carson took everybody to the park. He even grabbed Mackenzie. And the sisters can play football. Carson, why don't you teach Cashew how to ride a bike? Oh. It's Charlene. Ask Carson to help you with your bike. Yay. Oh, are you driving a spaceship? Just like mommy? Oh. Gonna be a pirate ship? You're going to make some salad? <laughs> you still need to do more football practice. Oh, good girl. Can you make it? No, she made her salad. Did you make it just for you, or...? Yeah. <laughs> you apparently want snacks. 
Anyone you can play football with? Your sister's still here. Well, you've ridden for four hours. No, don't go splash in the toilet. You were headed to the potty, young lady. Why'd you stop? Put your butt on the toilet. Sit. Good girl. Made it all the way there and went, You know, the grown-up potty looks fun to play in. What are y'all doing all the way over here? Get off your bike. There you go. Put it in your pocket. <laughs> it's not yours. He's gonna agree with him. Oh, she still has her... Uh -huh. Don't tip your sister. <laughs> it's pretty dark. Why don't you start headed home? No snack food. Head home. No. As soon as you're done pottying, we'll go home. There we go. Carson, bring the baby. Good job, Carson. What did you grab out of the fridge? Why'd you grab the sausage and peppers? That was working correctly. There was still more of the vegan stuff in there a new challenge bella needs a new challenge at work how does she ask the box present suggestions or demand a challenge suggestions bella hates waiting for others to give her ideas that's accurate so she presents her boss with suggestions for how she can be challenged bella's boss appreciates the gumption and praises her. Performance gain medium, medium. Ooh, Bella, look at that price you brought home. What happened? Spotted and bruised. The machines still remain our superior for now. Marvin is fitness level 5. Did we escape the house? We did. Okay, sad puppers. We need, no, we need something to take as an offering. It's uncommon. I think you need excellent food. Work on your homework for a bit. I'll have Bella make something. How about some churros? And he can take that to the little... Spritey Sprites. And it's Cashew's birthday. Yep. Wait. I just looked at this. Bella's birthday wasn't... Here. It was... What is going on? What? Why would she randomly change her birthday from when I started playing? You're not feeling well? Okay. Why are we frozen like this? Are you caught up in each other's eyes? Guys. <laughs> in a prep. Same wavelength. Yeah. You guys are on the same wavelength. I can't word. Oh. Okay, we'll quickly get that started. And then I'll cancel it. 
Okay. Leave that there. Run to the bathroom. Leave it there. You were waddling, girly. Take your medicine. Run to the bathroom. Huh. Bella Vanilla. I'm glad you feel better. Hurry up. Make some excellent churros, please. That is not how you start cooking excellently. We don't lose stuff in the ceiling. Speaking of ceilings, I need to paint the ceilings. We can do that now. Excellent job. Level 9. Yes! Look, Carson. She made you excellent churros. Let's go see the sprites. Y'all ever click on the wrong world repeatedly? Come offer your churros to the sprites. You don't have to be mad about it. You can go on a hunt. Ooh, it's winter. Ooh. Academic success? Did it work? Is Carson smarter? Time to go study and find out. Oh no. Your mom? She can't answer. Stop calling the baby. Now your mom died, Carson? I mean, you didn't have good compatibility and didn't really see each other. Oh, she was a passive parent? She just didn't pay attention to you at all, huh? But still, it's sad. No, you don't need that. Let's go home. Oh, no. And now Marvin's mom has passed away. We've just let, losing everyone. Bella, you said you were having brain withdrawal things. Please go knit something. Why don't you knit Cherry a sweater for when she's a big girl? That doesn't look like knitting. You're going to teach him to ride a bike in Marvin and Martina's room. Really? This just seems rude. Ranu! Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, he's really riding it. Oh good. Excellent job, buddy. Go get something to eat. Maybe if you do that, you can remember how to knit? Okay, she can teach to knit. Do your bony stuff. I didn't think you guys finished that. Apparently you did finish putting the top on it. I told you to eat first. What's this? You want to order some pizza? Order some pizza. That's what we'll have. Well... First, lick yourself a clean. Then you can work on your Tomb Raider? Your Tomb Raider. Really? Oh, what is wrong with my brain? Oh, there it is. University. Coursework. Term paper. No plagiarizing. Don't make a mess. Clean it up. So it looked like you were going to anyway. Then ride your bike around. Go live stream. 
Oh, now you want to hibernate? Oh, somebody saw you mark your territory. Practice sparring? Bella went to work. Till midnight. Everybody's going to age up without you. Yes, Leo. You're going to have to work on your term paper later, huh? Uh-oh. There she goes. I guess it makes for good live stream content. Sick tricks? When you did a trick without me? Oh no, the pizza. Moon rock running. Carrying a payload. Okay. Bella is cruising through Star Vortex B, carrying a payload of moon rocks for a regular client. But a brand new client calls with a better offer. Much better. Although she will have to quit her current job, should she honor the original job or ditch it for the better offer? Ignore the offer. Reputation is everything in this business. And Bella is just starting out. Better to be known as someone who gets the job done than to make a few extra simoleons. I didn't grab the pizza. Did you leave it somewhere? Yes. Awesome. We have pizza. Um, your leg broke. There you go. Good boy. What? She came home and got paid for her day of work. I'm just saying she aged up? What is going on with this game? How is her... Why is she suddenly aging up? Oh no. I don't understand how it jumped ahead. It was after the kids' birthday. Did the new pack like trigger the age up bug? Because this was around before that. Bella, I'm sorry. You shouldn't have aged up. Your birthday wasn't forgotten. There's something wrong. Can you still not knit? Okay. No, now you can suddenly knit. Huh? Whatever, she's home for the birthdays. Oh, Cashew did not make it to his bed. No, we're not going to be bed friends with a goat. Bed? Best friends with a ghost. Carson, you shouldn't be sad about that. It's weird. There we go. Cashew. Stop with the nonsense. What is with you children? Oh, you completed it. That was your last thing to do? Awesome. We managed to get that done? Hack animal. Wow. No, come on. Hack animal from completing playtime captain aspiration. These sims love improving themselves and others together. They have faster relationship and skill gain when training with friends. Pack Animal, the kid who idolizes a werewolf. Marvin. It's okay. She's just getting a bath. Okay. Uh, hi, excuse me, ghost lady, could you get out of my house? And not creepily watch the toddler? Get out! 
Marvin's having a midlife crisis, and Carson likes handiness. Early midlife crisis, huh, Marvin? Well, I know you'd rather do a different job. She got splashed. Carson, if you're done, can you take a picture of Cherry, please? Thank you. Cherry, is this what you're going to wear? You want to wear your little hearts? Cherry, can you get in the spot? There we go. Good girl. Lovely. Near my face, Carson. Man, the next gen of this is not going to be easy. Cashew, did you get... No. Alright, pictures are done. Let's start the birthday cakes. Alright, chop chop wiki wiki everybody. We got birthdays. Yeah. Alright, Cash Cashew is a horse lover. These Sims share a strong bond with horses. They have an easier time socializing with and caring for horses than other Sims. Cashew has high self esteem. Cute to actually have a teen one. You got an admired icon? Alright. <laughs> okay, girly, you age up too. There we go. Good job. And she's a glutton. Okay. We got motor. Which makes sense. That's her highest skill. There we go. Let's add birthday candles. Oh, Grandma sent stuff. And Grandma and Grandpa. Grandma sent stuff. And Uncle Bach. And your crazy dad. I mean, your erratic father. Who is definitely still crazy. Because he beat up his mom in this house. No more surprise birthdays, right? I still don't understand why her birthday suddenly jumped up several days. Let me dress you guys. Alright, I have to do that through the thingy my bob here. Okay, here's Cashew. He has, for some reason, decided to wear lipstick, but it's in his yellowish color, so... Some of this I just barely adjusted, because it seemed fine to me. Alright, now for Cherry. Okay, here's Cherry. I gave her back her little buns, because Sierra already has that up there. And she said she liked purple and pink. Here we go. All dressed, and I gotta fix her room. Oh, the bike returned. The one that said we didn't own. Yeah, please put the candles on real quick. Go on to bed, everyone. Sweetie, that's not bed. That's coffee. You know what else I want to do? Girls, we need to go ahead and have that baby. I know you're tired, Bella. Well... Somehow that helped make your sadness go away. 
Okay, yes. Oh, were you helping, Cherry? Good girl. I think Martina wants to do it, though. What are we getting? It's another girl! How about candy, Vanilla? Ooh, oh. We got a purple baby! A very light purple. Carson, did you pee in the toddler room? Well, let me move the baby. Alright, here's Cherry's room. She took a couple of her brother's things. And I aged up Cashew's room just a little bit. He still has a couple of void critter things. Are you running to the baby? Can we not put this in the inventory? There we go. I don't think that's what the baby wants. There's no stink cloud, so I'm going to guess. Do you have? No. Okay. Yeah. Candy's upset. Can, can you just come here? Bella, I'm pretty amazed that you think you can sleep through that. But you're the one that went and had the baby, so feed the baby. Buddy, go upstairs to your bed. Go on, Cassia. Oh. That's going to do it for me, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>